In this video, we'll be looking at the sum of the exterior angles of a polygon. First, let's look at where is an exterior angle. In this diagram, we have a hexagon, and vertex A is marked with this red dot. Um, if we were to uh, locate the exterior angle, we know that an exterior angle is formed by extending the side of a polygon. So let's extend uh, line segment BA at vertex A. And we can see then that our exterior angle is right here. Now at vertex A, if we wanted to extend the other side, um, FA, we could do that. And our exterior angle would be at this location. So the exterior angles of a polygon, let's just look at all of them for this hexagon. If we extend it at vertex A, here's our exterior angle. If we extend at vertex F, our exterior angle is here. If we extend at vertex E, our exterior angle is here. If we extend at vertex D, our exterior angle is here. And then if we extend at vertex C, our exterior angle is here. And if we extend at vertex B, our exterior angle is here. So the sum of all six exterior angles is what we're going to be looking for. We have a theorem then that says the sum of the exterior angles of any polygon is always equal to 360 degrees. This theorem can be used to solve a problem then. Our problem that we'll look at is to find the measure of an interior angle of a regular decagon. There is a formula for finding the measure of an interior angle but let's use this theorem to also solve it another way. Now, if we have a decagon, that means that we have 10 sides and 10 angles. So if the sum of the exterior angles is equal to 360, we can find the measure of one exterior angle by taking 360 divided by 10 for our decagon. So 360 divided by 10 gives us an exterior angle that measures 36 degrees. Now let me just sketch three sides and two angles of a decagon. And we could use this sketch for any um, number of sides. But we can label our exterior angle then by extending this side. Our exterior angle for this problem would be 36 degrees. Now since we have a straight angle here and our exterior angle is 36, then our interior angle can be found by subtracting 36 from 180. So 180 minus 36 is 144. So our interior angle then, right here, will be 144 degrees. So this gives us another way to find the measure of an interior angle as long as we have a regular inside polygon. 